juvies next with the exhibitions at Carlisle, Carlisle Juvenile Hurdle over two miles for four year olds only. Eccleston for Cara Ganti, Lee Marvin for Del Hinton, McGregor for Molly at Surfer, Crime Traveller for Martin Leedon, Frozen Rose for Pontypool Racing, Lady Godiva for Paul Rhodes, Neutron Star for Joshua Sutherland, O Ruby for Paul Rhodes, and Striking Wig for Darren Thompson, and Tin Mine for Carol Araganti. These four year olds, these juvies, they're away. Ruby, fairly successful of late. Probably looking at, uh, uh, I think, the Triumph Hurdle, the Champion Hurdle. I can't remember which uh, four year old event it is. At Cheltenham. Although he'll be taking on my fracking. Martin said uh, deserves to be in the handicap rather than uh, the actual big race. Well, we'll see with my Cheltenham specialist stable. Anyway, back to this race. They're already through two flights. They're going to go past the winning post with the circuit to go. And they're being led by Tin Mine. Two out wider, McGregor and Eccleston. Towards the fence, the pink silks of Lee Marvin. And Martin's crime traveller. Uh, length also back to Lady Godiva, Frozen Rose. A ruby jostling around. Neutron Star. Frozen roses or striking wig just out wide in the blue silks. As they come down to the next flight, it's Tin Mine, Crime Traveller, and Lee Marvin. Eccleston O Ruby, Neutron Star on the inside, and even well out on the outside now is O Ruby. Is that O Ruby dropping back? I can't. They're all jostling around terribly here. I'm not sure what the AI jockeys are up to, but it's Tin Mine that leads us. Much easier just to look what's going on up front. The rest are all just. Uh, Dancing around, taking a hold, pulling, pushing on, taking a hold. They've got themselves all jammed up together. They're over the third, and it's Lady Godiva that jumps himself in to challenge Tin Mine for the lead. But no, now having a pull. I don't know what these four year olds are all that. A little bit skittish. And it's Tin Mine that takes it back up again. With a mile left to travel. Tin Mine. And Lady Godiva and McGregor, they're the one, two, three. Neutron Star, O Ruby. Outside of O Ruby is Eccleston. Back towards the fence is Lee Marvin and Crime Traveller. And just the two of the rear are striking with on Frozen Rose the Grey. They go to the fourth. That's half the hurdles done. Lady Godiva nearly jumped up the back of Tim Mine there. And we're into the next. That's five down. And we're still being led by Tim Mine. Lady Godiva in second. McGregor in third. Neutron Star is four. Lee Marvin five. Eccleston six. Tin Mine heads for home now. He's off the bridle inside the five. He's got a couple of lengths advantage from Lady Godiva and two back to McGregor and Neutron Star. But it's still Tin Mine out of the pack. Here comes O Ruby. Ruby, Ruby, Ruby. And we're inside the final half a mile. And it's Tin Mine being challenged now by O Ruby. Pushing through well is Lee Marvin as well. So it's Tin Mine and O Ruby over the six together. They took it well. They both get away from it fine. It's O Ruby and Tin Mine. We're inside the three now. And O Ruby starts to pull away here. He's going to take a length advantage. It's O Ruby from Tim Mine in second, running on Lee Marvin and Neutron Star. They're all over that. There's a slow jump by O Ruby. Tim Mine almost got back up into challenge, but it's O Ruby still inside the furlong and a half. O Ruby from Tim Mine, Neutron Star, Lee Marvin, McGregor. But O Ruby skips over that one and pulls away from the field. It's only a furlong left to run now, and he's already got a five length advantage. But here comes Neutron Star to try and close the gap with Lee Marvin and McGregor. But O Ruby's going to hang on to this comfortably in the end. O Ruby Ruby takes it. Oh, Ruby, 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 Ruby wins the exhibitions at Carlisle Juvenile Hurdle by three to four lengths. Neutron Star got up for second for Joshua Sutherland. Third was Lee Marvin for Del Hinton. Fourth was McGregor for Molly at Surfer. And fifth was Crime Traveller for Martin Leader.